Hello everyone. On behalf of the team, I would like to thank you for attending our presentation entitled Nerve Growth Factor Precursor. The ProNGF exerts different biological action on urothelial cells and smooth muscle cells of rodent bladders. Nothing to disclose. So, a little bit of a background. So, ProNGF is found to activate a P75 and receptor. Uh, which is all expressed in the bladder in both in the urothelial and smooth muscle cells in addition to the neuro neuro neuronal cells uh, and uh, this interaction was found to activate the death domain of the p75 to induce apoptosis by activating tnf alpha rho a and other pathways at the same time in other cells the, it, it was found to activate the nf kappa b translocation to the nucleus to induce survival so in addition to these facts, the pro-NGF was found to build up in conditions such as diabetes, inflammation, and ischemia, and we know that these conditions are associated with changes in the bladder function and morphology. So we aim to identify the biological effect of pro-NGF and P75 activation on urothelial cells and smooth muscle cells, uh, which were cultured from rodents' bladder, from Sprague down the rats. So we cultivated urothelial and smooth muscle cells from the bladders of females, Prague down the rats, and we used passages from two to six. Uh, after confluency, the cells were um, starved, and we incubated the cells with a pro-NGF, the cleavage-resistant pro-NGF, uh, at concentrations of five and 10 nanomolar for different durations. Uh, we extract, uh, extracted the proteins and the nuclear proteins to test the TNF-alpha way activation, NFF-kappa-P levels by Western blotting, in addition to doing immunofluorescence. Then we check the cell viability by doing the MTT test. In the urothelial cells, we found that when the urothelial cells were incubated with pro-NGF of 10 nanomolar concentration, we found that there was a significant reduction in the viability of these cells compared to the control cells after 24 hours. When we tested which pathways were activated, we found that incubation of the urothelial cells with pro-NGF for 24 hours and 48 hours, we found that there is an increase in the transmembrane expression of TNF-alpha, and this was dose-dependent. So the more you give pro-NGF, the more the TNF-alpha expression was there. In addition to that, when the, these cells were incubated for short time with pro-NGF at a concentration of 10 nanomolar, we found that there was an activation of rho A. However, the NF-kappa B activation wasn't seen in the urothelial cells after 30 minutes. So no nuclear translocation in this case. On the other side, the smooth muscle cells did not show any change in the viability when they were incubated with pro-NGF for 24 hours in starving conditions. Uh, we couldn't also see any TNF-alpha activation or rho activation by incubation of pro-NGF at the two doses, the 10 and 5 nanomolar. While this incubation, the incubation of these cells with pro-NGF for 30 minutes, induced significantly the translocation of nf kappa b to the nucleus as we can see in the the, the histochemistry the cytochemistry on the right side when the cells the nucle nuclear translocation of nf kappa b can be concentrated into the nucleus and we compare that to the lps as a positive control now, in the urothelial cells, to conclude, we found that in urothelial cells, the pro-NGF P75 uh, axis increased the TNF-alpha and rho A activation, possibly by the death domain, while the smooth muscle cells did not show this reduced viability or activation. Uh, it's rather resulted in translocation of nf kappa B to the nucleus uh, when they were exposed to pro-NGF. So these results suggest that pro-NGF causes degenerative changes in the urothelial cells and opposing effects to smooth muscle cells that promote cell response to stress. So the take-home message is that the bladder, for, as for other organs, the neurotroph neurotrophins, some like pro-NGF, can act beyond affecting the neurons to activate pathways that impact urothelial and smooth muscle cell function in the bladder. Thank you.